Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing what is the next big surprise that's coming towards you. So if you'd like to choose group number one, group number two, group number three, group number four, and let's get started as to what big surprise is coming for you. So starting off with group number one with the rose quartz. Okay, so we have a very messy pile here. Um, <laughs> so group number one, we have your pile here. So we have the tarot. So for your cards in the tarot, we have the Four of Cups and the Clarified by the King of Swords. So we want to keep these up here. So this is the next big surprise that is coming towards you. So we also have Magic of Nature, Chemistry, Courage, Heart Protection, Your Hard Work is Paying Off. The end of tough cycle approaches and meditate and contemplate in reverse. So I do feel like the next big surprise coming towards you is somebody telling you how they really feel. I do feel like this is coming through very strongly. There's somebody, for something to do with nature as well, it could be something to do with nature. Um, I do feel like you could love to go and walk with this person or they could just love nature. They could just be very earthy or they could, or you could just have a really good time with them to be honest. Um, I feel like you both have a lot of chemistry and I feel like it could be an air sign. Or they could just be connected to an air sign, I feel like. Um, or you could be an air sign. I feel like it could be air and water. Okay, I feel like this person could be coming towards you for an offer. offer or you're going to come towards them. Because we have it. hard work is paying off at the end of a tough cycle approach. And this person meditating and contemplating. They could even be a Pisces or a Capricorn as well. I do feel like they have closed their heart off for long enough now. Like, for some reason they're saying they've closed their heart off for long enough now. And they're ready to come towards you. This is basically just the message. It's a very clear message. Like, that's literally it. That's literally the whole message. Um, so there's somebody who needs to take a lot of courage to come towards you. I feel like either you've blocked your heart off or they've blocked their heart off. They've just closed it. They have these closed walls. But I feel like they're just going to be open. I feel like they're going to be open... And they're going to come towards you um, because this end of a tough cycle approach is where you're not going to be possibly single anymore. You're going to be actually in a relationship. And I feel like this is actually really surprising because I feel like you have been single for a long time. And I feel like you've been going through so much crap with all these people and you just want to have a good relationship with somebody, okay? If you don't want a relationship with somebody, this could just be a really, really good offer that you accept. It could even be to do with work, but I do feel like it could be some sort of like communication for somebody you really, really care about, okay? Could just be, and then it's like a really good thing. So it could even be a friend coming back um, and you're like, oh my God, I missed you so much. Or they could have been like a friend who kind of went off for a few years and kind of went to a different country and come back again. And then they come back and talking to you again. It's that sort of energy where it's been like still in the communication. I feel like... I feel like you have been communicating with this person or you or like you or you haven't there's two different ways you could be contact could be talking to them or you could not but i do feel like someone's coming towards you if you don't know who this is you're in for a ride <laughs> you're in for a surprise that's basically what it is so that's the message i really hope it's resonated if it didn't resonate then just let it fly or choose another group feel free um if you would like to uh, book a private read with me all my readings are in the description below as to what i offer if you'd like to subscribe to my channel uh the red button is down below i'd love for you to subscribe thank you so much for so bleh, i can't speak cancerian season thank you so much for watching and i'll speak to you very soon love you guys bye hello group number two thank you so much for being here let's see what next surprises are coming towards you so i did repaint my nails um if they look a bit different from uh, group one it's because i couldn't stand the edges being all chipped and stuff so we're moving on and we uh i adjusted that i, I repainted my nails <laughs> okay so let's see what you got going for you in the tarot we have the oh the knight of wands with the queen of wands oh hello that's gorgeous this is the clarifier for the knight of wands which is amazing so let's see what surprises is coming for you so we have parenting and children it is safe for you to love emotions protection surrender to the divine a romantic cycle begins and you are good enough wow so similar to group number one this is a new cycle for love coming through i feel like somebody 
has been ready for a long time this is possibly you who's been ready to kind of be like yes let's go 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 but there's never actually been anyone who's really like kind of sparked your interest or somebody who you've never kind of got along with it's always kind of been like person after person or it's just never been the right person okay i feel like you could be single for a long time but now i feel like you know your worth more than what you did like possibly last year and i'm getting the song stronger um by britney spears uh, you're stronger than yesterday so that's kind of what i'm getting um, it is safe for you to love. I feel like you are protecting your emotions because you've been hurt so much. And it's safe for you to love. It's safe for you to go into this romantic cycle, which is absolutely amazing. I feel like you could feel very, very safe with this person. Um, but there's somebody who, who's coming in divine timing. You have been waiting for this person for a long time. I feel like this is for sure a soulmate because it just feels really loving and really amazing. I love this card. You are good enough. I just love that so much. Because I feel like you could be feeling really insecure. Like, oh, it's never going to happen. But actually it is gonna happen because this is the card for you my dear um i just generally feel like my dear i've never said that <laughs> but i am um, i'm getting like mothering energy right there so i do feel like um the it, the person is coming like you you're, you need to surrender to the divine you need to know they are coming and they are and they're gonna see you in your power and they're gonna come towards you okay because you are good enough this person is good enough for you and you're gonna have an amazing relationship with this person so the next surprise coming towards you is a neuromantic cycle my friend so let's see um what comes through in the tarot i feel like i want to look into their zodiac sign it obviously doesn't have to resonate but i do feel like it could be this person okay so possible star signs let's have a look so we have aquarius pisces What else wants to come from? I'm getting like, uh, what is that? Libra? We've got Libra here anyway, so it could be a Libra or a Virgo as well. Must be getting Cancerian. Or... Are you going to come out? One, two, three, four, five. Libra, there we go. And Aries and Leo. Okay, so then we have Taurus, that is behind another possible star sign. These are the possible star signs here. Doesn't have to be them, but it can be, okay? So I do feel like you've worked on yourself a lot. I feel like your ego has gotten smaller. For some reason, they're telling me ego is smaller. I've got big ego and it's like like this. It's like gone from this to this. So it's almost like your whole body was full of this ego. I'm not saying you had a big ego, but I feel like everyone, everyone has a big ego because it's like almost like you have to battle with that ego and, and tell yourself that you are good enough and you've gone through so much shit. It's like you deserve this. You deserve this so much and you two are going to be working in union. It's like two little lions here. I don't know if you can see. And I can see them like, they look like they're dancing. I don't know why I'm really attracted to that. Possibly could be the Leo energy, but I feel like they're you're going to be very empowered. You're going to have a lot of fun with this person. And I feel like because you've been working on your ego, you've been working on that part of you that wants to control, that wants to solve things, that wants to analyse, overanalyse, overthink. And I feel like that has actually gotten much smaller over time. And I definitely feel like you've been working on that. So I really hope this helps. If it doesn't resonate, then just let it fly. I also feel like if you are looking for somebody and this is just you're already in a relationship, I do feel like you possibly could be moving on to a new partner if you feel like your partnership isn't going that great. But if it is, then I do see a kind of a new cycle with this romantic partner coming forward where you possibly could be going up to a new level, um, possibly going from dating to partnership to babies that sort of thing engagement that sort of thing okay and you are good enough you are good enough for somebody okay so thank you so much for watching if it resonated then uh please feel free to comment down below if it didn't then let it fly or choose another group please feel free to subscribe down below the red button is down below also if you like a private re reading ugh, cancerian moon makes my speech go all weird if you'd like a private reading with me all my readings are listed in the description below so thank you so much for watching i'll speak to you very soon bye hello group number three thank you so much for being here and for watching this video so let's see for group number three what surprises are coming towards you let's have a look in the tarot so first of all we have the seven of swords with the nine of pentacles this is the clarifier for this card so let's see what's coming on for you what's the next surprise coming for you we have raising your standards religious factors transformation oh a personal issue reach of evolution nothing will come in this situation and time for healing right okay so you guys are in still mode at the moment they're telling me still mode you guys are coming out of something really really bad <laughs> and into something really good okay you kind of are coming out of this energy 
where it's just deceiving and it's nasty toxic i'm getting the word toxic i feel like for you your surprise is not really a physical thing it's almost like an emotional thing it's basically where you are transforming into this gorgeous person where you're raising your standards and you're not letting anybody kind of sway who you are you're being very authentic you're like this is what i believe in it doesn't have to be, you don't even have to be religious it's basically just like i believe in this certain thing you don't have to believe in it but i do and i definitely feel like you're going through a massive transformation a surprise for you i feel like it's just general happiness which is amazing i feel like this group has suffered a lot with their stuff okay they've gone through a lot of stuff they've gone through a lot of times where people have treated them really badly i feel like you guys are just empowered you guys are powering through you guys are empowered you are you have done the healing a personal issue reached revolution this could even be for health i don't even normally talk about health on this channel but i feel like this could even be for health as well i feel like you're going out of a health situation obviously i'm not guaranteeing that you are but if you feel like you are getting better um then i definitely feel like that could be a sign okay obviously i'm not this is like a general reading okay so please take it with a grain of salt um i feel like you felt like in a void i feel like you felt like nothing was going to happen and it was just kind of it was for some reason they're telling me closing time so i'm not sure if that song that says closing time i don't know what that song is but that's kind of what i'm hearing i feel like the doors are closing now on an old chapter and you're going into a new chapter i felt like you felt like this for a long long time i'm i'm, I'm here at least 5 10 20 years where you felt like you just had to heal and heal and heal and transform and heal and heal and transform now it's all coming through honey it is coming through for some reason i feel really sassy so i don't know if a lot of you are really sassy i'll never say honey like that so if you guys are really sassy then this is you i put in the word to say hunty as well <laughs> this is so funny this is so sassy um so yes yes girl yes girl or guy doesn't really matter yes <laughs> this is amazing okay you guys have gone for a really amazing healing time i feel i need to kind of pull out a couple more cards for you guys just to see what else is coming for you I'm getting sun card vibes for you guys. Oh, gorgeous. We have the high priestess and judgment. I feel like you're, you're going through a spiritual transformation, actually. And the judgment for you is like, look at what you have now. Look at how amazing your life's going to be. And you're looking at how much you've gone through. You're like, wow, I've gone through so much. My legs are tingling like no tomorrow as well. So I do feel like that is pretty much accurate for you guys. I'm going to pull a crystal card for you and just see what else is, is coming for you guys. Feel like you guys deserve more cards the other groups didn't have this so i definitely feel like you should have this guys okay so underneath the deck we have prenite release and glee Blah. okay cancer and moon mucking up my speech release and declutter prenite release and declutter heart chakra you guys are releasing and decluttering all the old crap goodbye goodbye see you later no one likes you goodbye um <laughs> so we have citrine abundance and creativity solar plexus we also have moonstone moon cycles crown chakra I like family third eye chakra i feel like you're going to be a little bit close to your family as well if you haven't been very close to them i feel like you could be more close to them i feel like because of this pit issue being resolved whatever this issue is it could even be your family i feel like you're going to be close to your family this is going to be a this is a cycle it's a definite cycle and i feel like because of this new moon coming together with, with cancer um it's almost like obviously i know it's this full moon but with new moon i do feel like there's like a whole new cycle for you connecting with people and i feel like you're going to be connecting with much more higher vibrational people who are on your level okay um just on your level in general and you're going to have so much more abundance and creativity within this new cycle in the next 20 years i'm seeing after this this is this is absolutely amazing and i feel like the reason to pull this card is so for you to love um chemistry and honeymoon i do feel like you're coming into a new love cycle as well so there could be somebody on the horizon for you in the next six to 12 months okay gonna be a little bit wild. i've seen three six and twelve so it could be in that sort of area obviously this is a general reading so it's gonna be for quite a few of you i feel like you're gonna be much more artistic um we have prosperity lies ahead which is absolutely amazing we also show the world the real you i feel like you are definitely doing this you are channeling this goddess energy obviously it doesn't matter if you're a guy or a girl you're channeling this amazing energy where you're coming more balanced you're becoming more yourself and it's absolutely amazing it's paying off it's just paying off and prosperity lies ahead for you guys i'm getting really excited i feel like this is going to help you with your money as well because you're being so authentic it's almost like the universe is like okay let's give this person everything they want okay so yeah 
it's amazing. I feel like you're going to have more chemistry with yourself. I feel like you're going to have much more love for yourself, which is gorgeous. And it's safe for you to love and you're going to have something coming for forward towards you. It's going to be amazing. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Let me know if it resonates down below in the comment section. Also, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, the uh, red button is down below. If this does not did not resonate with you, then feel free to choose another group or just let it fly. Also, I do private readings. So if you would like to book a private reading with me, all the information is down below. I list all my readings that I do with all the price ranges so you can choose an option then email or Instagram me Instagram message me and I'll speak to you very soon bye guys love you lots bye hello group number four thank you so much for clicking on this video we have the gorgeous amethyst here I love this crystal I always have to show this crystal off because I just think it's absolutely beautiful I mean stunning I love it so so pretty so thank you so much for clicking on this video let's see what is coming towards you for the what is the surprise is coming towards you I'm sorry about my speech if it kind of like I'm rambling or anything it's just this cancer and moon is really messing up my speech so I'm um, just letting you know okay <laughs> so we have the four of swords with the clarified with the is this in reverse or is this not in reverse this is in reverse the nine of wands with the ace of wands so is that in reverse okay okay i'm sorry guys but i'm gonna have to reshuffle these because for some reason they're not showing me what the answer is so let's do this again so what's coming forward for group number four please there we go thank you very much there we go wow that's much better <laughs> okay so that's a possible outcome they're telling me, but telling me this one is more suited. They have the, we have the five of wands underneath, okay? So, you guys, there's so much love going on. I don't know if you, a lot of you guys are getting together with people, but this is like the, the third, the third group. The only group that didn't have this is group number three, which is insane, okay? So we have peace of mind, pay attention to red flags, cleanse, spirit guides, communication, solutions, you and your loved ones are safe, nothing is yet set in stone, and it's time to keep around the take. And I'm smiling right now because we have the new mini cancel, which is exactly what's been going on. So you guys are going to get matched up in this new moon, okay? I do genuinely feel like a surprise that's coming for you. Also, if you're not watching this in the new moon, don't worry about it. It's just that's the energy that's been coming through. Um, obviously, it doesn't really matter on timing. Uh, this is a timeless reading. So the next surprise that's coming for you, for you is... A new relationship i'm seeing a new relationship there's several there's different things for you guys okay so we also have communication from somebody we have a cleanse to do with kind of cleansing out toxic relationships i feel like you're going to have a lot of cleansing a lot of purging to do with toxic relationships you're going to be purging out a lot of these and you're going to be standing your ground and saying no bitch you ain't getting in my zone back off um so i feel like you're giving out a lot of love and because you are doing this and you're standing your ground you're going to have this really gorgeous relationship there could also be two choices between two people and also there could be two choices just in a certain situation okay we have pay attention to the red flags i do feel like this is to do with toxic relationships you could be a little bit wary you could have possible trust issues because of certain people in the past but i feel like if you cleanse and you kind of get rid of the old stuff that's not going to be a problem anymore because the spirit guides are helping you with this and you're going to be able to communicate how you really feel and there's going to be a solution as to how you're going to uh, manifest this okay it's going to be absolutely gorgeous i love the fact we've got the lovers and solutions so i do feel like this can also be an offer of emotional stability to do somebody in a relationship could even be a friendship i'm feeling more romantic but it can also be an offer of something stable to do with money as well because we have the lovers and the hierophant and i do feel like it's someone in a like authority figure as i say it could be various different amounts it could be somebody who it could be you where you're kind of standing your ground and saying no i'm not dealing with any of this crap i want somebody who's authentic and i'm gonna love them forever and ever and that's what's coming through and say it could also be money and could also an offer of money something stable and also could, i do generally feel like it could be like a job that could be really really fulfilling for you and you're gonna absolutely love it you could even meet another person you could even meet a person at work i'm here another person so i'm not sure if some of you are actually in relationships if you are in relationships i do feel like you're you could just have an offer of something that's going to be really prosperous for you it's going to be something that's going to be very stable very like four of ones energy here and it's going to be like thank god i need this really really badly and you're gonna get it you're definitely gonna get it and it's almost like thank god and you're gonna feel much more grounded as well because you've got this offer so with these cards here if you feel like nothing is coming in 
it doesn't mean that nothing is coming in okay there is something coming in for you you may not expect it it may not be actually what i'm saying they're telling me it could be something that is unexpected as well hence why i'm not meant to tell you um obviously i can't i can't pick it up they're just telling me it could be a surprise as well um it's hard to give rather than take i feel like someone's going to give to you rather than take i feel like a lot of people have taken from you in the past and i feel like now is your time to shine now is your time to shine and i do feel like a new job is coming towards towards you i feel like for some reason i'm getting pharmacy so i'm not sure if anyone any of you want to work in pharmacy or medical field anything like that where you're helping people i do feel like a lot of you are going to be doing that possibly nursing school that sort of thing um i also feel like you are feeling more safe within relationships you're feeling more safe within friendships any sort of relationship could be even to do with family um and you're just going to feel really safe with this person okay so thank you so much for watching. Also, they're telling me you could have a family with this person that's coming through. It could be a Pisces. Uh, I also want to pull out a zodiac sign to see who you're interacting with this person, okay? So we've got Libra. Who else is coming through? I'm getting Leo quite strong, so I'm not sure if Leo's coming through. Oh, there he is. He or she, there they are. I <laughs> uh, love that. Okay. Leo loves to come through. He was like charging ahead, like, okay, it's my turn. Three, four, five. We have Taurus, Sagittarius, Aries, Cancerian, and Virgo. We also have Pisces underneath, but that's all the star signs that I'm seeing. So thank you so much for watching guys. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below if it's resonated. If it didn't, then just let it fly or choose on the group. Please comment down below if it did. And also, I'm sorry I said if I repeated myself, Cancer and Moon, ugh. Um, <laughs> uh, subscribe if I haven't said that already. Oh dear Lord. Um, <laughs> if you would like to get a personal reading with me, then all the information is down below for a private reading. Uh, I have all my readings listed down below so you can choose which one you want. I also have my price range there so you can look before you actually purchase one. Uh, and please feel free to connect with me on Instagram. I do pick a cards and just general Q&As on there. And also, that's it. Uh, yeah, if it doesn't resonate, let it fly. And I'll speak to you very soon. Love you guys. Bye.